Hey guys, I'm Ross Vane, and welcome back to another Sunset Overdrive. Don't know why, but if you don't know, for the last two parts, they were just straight up the new DLC or the next DLC. But it, they're they're going in really fast. Like we're doing the missions one by one down down one by one very quickly. So I'm kind of weirded out about it. So yeah. Anyways, now we're open to explore this area now, the moon grill now, so, or the moon rig. So right now we can't really exit out of the area. Okay, now we're not moving fast in the grills. What the hell is that? Stay down, dude. Stay down. Oh, he also explodes in. Uh... Yeah, because I can't really whack him. I gotta shoot him to finish him off. Apparently, that's the strategy with him. There's no gun store or anything? No Floyd in there? Let's do the side quest. I'm curious about the side quest because it seems like we're moving too quickly with this mission and I know it's good but at the same time it's pretty scary. What the hell's going on? What 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 is going on? Anyways it started. Is there anything I can help you with? I was going to ask you the same thing. Herbert, who is that? Just a friend, Mother. You stay away from strange adults. They probably have germs. Your mother's right. I am an adult and I do have germs. But I am not the strange one in this scenario. Oh, I just want to do something fun. Hey, I can make you a weapon if you get me some parts. What do you say? Feel the burn? Is that a gun, really? Alright, let's do it. Mommy issues. So, Herbert, your mother, explain. I was working out here for a few weeks, and one day I sent Mom an email telling her I was a little lonely. That's it. I, I, I said a little lonely, and she shows up the next day. I could read between the lines, sweetheart. You gotta find something to hook onto this thing. Mothers think they know best. Oh, well. Maybe I can use a crane. Crane. Okay, I guess. <laughs> I'm like looking around like crane. Wait, is those real people? Oh, what the hell? They don't seem to take me lightly. So it became a skag area? A scab area? Skag. Scab. Whatever. It's sort of scab area, really. Skag. Skag is like oh no no uh, yeah Skag is like somewhere in Borderlands. I accidentally <laughs> mixed up the two in terms of names. That is. All right, I gotta find my way. What the hell? Ooh, whoa, whoa! I don't mean to hurt you guys, but you guys have started wailing on me, so I gotta wail on you guys back. I need to get back up there. Oh no, I messed up. Got to do it again. Oh no, I gotta do the. Oh, there we go. Much better. Okay, let's hurry up and jump all the way up. I don't think I can get the weapons in time. So this side quest is pretty simple, I would say. Is this another one of those? Pick it up and uh, we'll we'll make it for you kind of situations. Alright, we're here near the crane already. I believe there should be an entrance to it. Or a way to control it. Oh, hey! Why are there workers chasing after me? I like I didn't do anything wrong until I walked here. Alright. Well, start it up. There we go. Find a way to break the cage open. And he, we're just seeing a guy who's stuck in a freaking bunch of barrels and stuff. Oh, there we go. Okay, I 
gotta get down there and pick up that part. <laughs> like I was just like I don't know where I see. It's like, like everything just kills. I just killed everybody there. All right, let's go and. Picked it up. Okay, Herbert. Cool. I got a weapon part. Great. Just a couple more parts, and we got ourselves a weapon. Herbert, don't encourage dangerous behavior. Someone will get hurt, and they'll blame you, and then you'll get sued for yep. damages. How can you get sued at this position? It's a mother's job. No, it's not. God, Mom, you always do this. Do what, dear? Whenever you know you're being annoying, you always say, It's my job as a mother to ba 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 It's not your job to suffocate me! <laughs> Herbert? What? Have you ever been a mother? Hmm? Okay, got another one. <laughs> nice! Okay, I'm having fun. Are you having fun? Loads. Just one more piece, and I can make you something really cool. Mom, we need to have a talk. I think it's time you head back home. But I am home, dear. No! This isn't home. This is a tiny closet on an oil rig that's barely big enough for one person. And being stuck here with you is making me crazy. You're not crazy, Herbert. You are perfectly sane. Don't insult yourself. It's unattractive. I was trying to insult you, Mom! What? Why are you looking at me? So it gets up in that grave. There's got to be a way up there. Don't do that, Mom. <laughs> okay, got the last piece. Good job. Come on back, dear. your weapon um, I hope you like it dear you know the saddest part about that whole thing is that most people under 30 won't get the reference really I am under 30 <laughs> I am under 30 years of age and I do not get that reference at all Build feel the burn weapon for a guy who is something something I don't know. I I'm gonna guess he's crazy. He has t probably a two side personality. I don't know. It reminds me of uh, Outlast Whistleblower, which I haven't really played yet. But I know that one scene where that where it was one person who was just like being dual personalities and stuff. Anyways, that was I was sort of anticipating when I heard the last part. I was like, this kind of feels like somebody with one with two personalities and uh, I can't explain it I don't think I can explain it <laughs> it's somewhat psychological I don't know much about that portion at all but anyways thank you guys for watching leave a like comment subscribe if you guys haven't make sure to check down the description box or click on annotations to check out more stuff on the channel and video hope see you guys in the next part or another video of mine and I hope you guys have a great amazing day week and night or whenever you're watching this so Roz Yeah, because he's, like, he's chasing after me. Ooh, so that's good.